Hi, my name is Anna Neubauer and I'm a portrait photographer. Today we're going to use some glare one lights and I'm going to show you what we can use them for to recreate a natural light look. So this is the Glare One LED 300 bicolor D light. It's an incredibly powerful light. It has a CRI of 95 plus, which is perfect for situations where accurate color reproduction is crucial. The 300D has a color temperature spectrum of 2700 to 6500, which is great for such a powerful light because you can mimic daylight and even moonlight. You can use it for all kinds of things like portrait photography or product photography, where you want the light to be consistent. Today we have two beautiful models, Joanne and her son Marcus, and we're going to shoot some very intimate and soft images that really show their connection. I usually don't work with lots of studio lights, but this light is amazing for recreating natural light, so we're going to put it to the test. This space has quite a lot of natural light anyway, but it's coming from all kinds of directions. And I think with this light, you can make it look like it's an incredibly sunny day and you get all these warm tones, which I love. <laughs> it just makes this place even more amazing. Like it all feels like sunshine. <laughs> with warm tones, you can get these really nice and soft images that show the connection between two people even more. So the other light we're using today is the Glare One LED Tube RGB. It has 360 RGB colors, which means that you can be incredibly creative with it. You can shoot music videos with it, but you can also use it for photo shoots. Just like the other light, it has a CRI of 95 plus for high quality color reproduction and a built-in diffuser for soft lighting, which I love. It's really small, so you can take it anywhere you want and it's perfect for on-location shoots. So I think the cool thing about it is that you can switch from warm tones to cool tones and if you shoot a music video you can get this really dramatic effect. It's so tiny but it actually looks really cool because it just looks like golden hour <laughs> if you set it to like orange. <laughs> To be honest, I'm blown away by these lights. As I said before, I don't really work with studio lights that much, but the Glare One lights today were incredible. They're so easy to move around. They're incredibly easy to set up and you can be really creative. I don't usually put the lights right in front of the model's faces because I think it looks a bit unnatural. So I go with the sides or behind them. I really like backlight because it recreates this really nice glow. This place has a lot of natural light anyway, but if you put the lights behind the models or right next to them, you can just add a bit more sunshine. I don't really direct the models that much and I think Lots of light can be a distraction. So if I place the lights on the sides or behind the models, I feel like it distracts them less from being natural. As a photographer, you obviously want to work with the most amazing equipment and the best equipment, but it's also super expensive and I'm just blown away by the performance and everything is super affordable. 
To be honest, I never thought I would have so much fun with a LED tube. You can be so creative. You can hold it in your hand or you can put it on the stand. You can like even give it to your models and they can hold it. And I think you can literally do anything you want with it. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure to subscribe and see you next time.